Hi, hello students. This is Karthi Shweri from Tirunelveli, Tamil Nadu. First, I like to introduce myself. I am a Fevicryl Certificate Expert Teacher for past 8 years and I am a fashion designer running Fashion Designing Institute in my own area. In this section, I am going to teach you a wonderful fridge magnets. Let me first show you what are the fridge magnets. Uh, just a sample which I have made and I will uh, explain more type. This is a honeycomb, honeybee fish magnet. See here. You can paint here. And then a normal board fish magnet. Okay. So my section will be both in Hindi and English so that many can understand. So now for making fish magnets, I take my fevicryl molded clay. So this clay is used for molding purpose. And if you open it, you have two components. So my abhi a fevicryl molded clay use kar rahi hu. Iske andar do cheez hoga. Do clay hai. Isme ek hai. Aisa aap grey color. Grey color hoga. Aap dousra ek white color hoga. हमें इस दोनों क्ले को अच्छी तरह से मिक्स करना है। We have to mix the two clay properly. The proportion must be equal. If you are using half the packet of this white, you have to take the half the packet of this clay also and mix it properly. That is, the proportion should be equal. So I take two uh, clay together and mixing it. So before mixing, you can apply any talcum powder in your hand. Whatever talcum powder you can ha you have, you can take it. आपको पहले talcum powder को अपने हाथों में दबाना चाहिए. ऐसे. You have to spread all over the hand so that it will not be sticky in your hand. Okay. So now you have to mix the clay. You have to mix such that it is become white color. पूरी तरह से mix करना है. ऐसे दो कलर है देखिए दो कलर है इसे अच्छी तरह मिक्स करने से आपको प्योर वाइट मिलेगा अच्छी तरह से आपका मिक्स करना है ऐसे ऐसे भी मिक्स कर सकते हैं पर थोड़ा टाइम लगेगा इस तरह घुमाकर घुमाकर मिक्स करने से थोड़ा जल्दी हो जाएगा ऐसे मिक्स करना है You have to mix it like this. So, uh, एक ले पूरी तरह से mix होने के बाद half an hour में dry हो जाएगा. उसके पहले हम जो करना है उसे करना चाहिए. ऐसे इस तरह अच्छी से mix करना है. Half mix करने से clay dry नहीं होगा. कितने दिन होने पर भी ड्राई नहीं होगा इसलिए आपको अच्छे तरह से मिक्स करना है कोई मार्बल इफेक्ट वैसे होगा तो आपका क्ले तैयार नहीं है इसलिए अच्छी तरह से मिक्स करना है अगर आपको कुछ स्टिकी क्ले स्टिकी लगेंगे तो आप ऐसे हाथ में पाउडर लगा सकते हैं So you can mix the clay properly. If you feel little bit sticky, if the clay is little bit sticky, you can apply powder in your hand and then you can mix it thoroughly. You have to mix it thoroughly. See the color is pure white. There is no marble effect. The clay is pure white. Now you can make whatever you want. See now the clay texture is very soft. It is very soft so that you can make any shapes. Now I am going to tell you the basic thing. Okay. So before that the surface which you are doing that is any table or anything. You have to take a plastic sheet or you can use your OHP sheet. Aapko jis mein karna hai, aap kar rahe hai. Us mein koi plastic sheet hona chahiye ya koi OHP sheet vagera you aap use kar sakte hai. उसमें पहले पाउडर को स्प्रेड करना है ताकि उसमें स्टिक ना हो जाएगा इसलिए हम पाउडर को ऐसे स्प्रेड करेंगे हमारे एरिया में 
सो so, मैं अभी यहाँ वर्क करने वाली हूँ इसलिए मैं उस एरिया को पाउडर से स्प्रेड करती हूँ ताकि उसमें स्टिक ना हो जाएगा ठीक है अभी मैं ऐसा लेती हूँ पहले मैं एक फ्लावर फ्रिज मैगनेट आपको बता रही हूँ उसके लिए हम थोड़ी सी ओके okay, हम क्ले कम से यूज करना है ताकि वो वेट ना बन जाए इसलिए हम फ्रिज में चिपते समय वो इतना स्ट्रांग होगा पर नीचे नहीं गिर जाएगा अगर वो वेट ज्यादा हो तो नीचे गिर जाएगा इसलिए हम क्ले ज्यादा नहीं यूज करना चाहिए वी हैव यू शुड नॉट यूज मोर अमाउंट ऑफ क्ले बिकॉज इफ द वेट इज हाई इट विल नॉट प्रॉपरली स्टिक इन द फ्रिज सो आई रिक्वेस्ट एवरी वन टू यूज ओनली लेस अमाउंट ऑफ क्ले तो ऐसे आपको बॉल लेना है यू हैव टू टेक लाइक दिस अ स्मॉल बॉल दिस बॉल साइज इज लाइक चन्ना साइज यू कैन टेक द चन्ना बॉल साइज ओके एंड देन जस्ट प्रेस लाइक दिस जस्ट फ्लैटरिंग इट एंड जस्ट फ्लैटरिंग इट ओके I just flattered it. I had made as a round, okay, and I have kept it like I said. Now I take small, ah, uh, small size ball, okay. I'm taking one five small, five or six small size ball. That is up to you. That we are going to make the petals, okay. So that is up to you. We are making a small balls. Now my balls are ready. Now I'm going to show you how to make the petals. So I take small ball size ball and just keeping it in the palm and just strapping it at the one end so that you will get a cone shape or teardrop shape like this. See here, a teardrop shape. When you press that with the finger, you will get a petals like this. This is very simple. I'm going to tell you again. Just take a ball. इस तरह से एक ball लेना है. और आपके पाम यहाँ रखकर ऐसे घुमाना है इसे एक ही साइड में ताकि आपको एक लेंथी सी जाएगा ऐसे एक पेटल साइज का फिर उस पर को टीय ड्रॉप शेप इसे प्रेस करने से आपको पेटल मिल जाएगा एंड आई एम गोइंग टू रिपीट इट वंस अगेन एंड जस्ट टेकिंग अ बॉल जस्ट कीपिंग इट इन द हैंड जस्ट शैपरिंग इट लाइक दिस वन एंड एंड आई हैव गॉट अ The tear drop shape. Just I'm pressing it so that I get a petal. Okay. Just I'm doing it all for all five. Okay. Hope you all understand this. Just I'm repeating it once again. I take a ball, just trapping it at one side, and just pressing it with the finger so that I get a petal shape. Now, first previously I have made the ball right. Ah, uh, that is a flatter center part. Now I am just keeping this at the back and just sticking it at the back like this. Okay. So when you take even amount of ah uh, clay for the balls, you will get even ah uh, size. petals hope you all can see this see so you, uh, the number of petals is depends upon you you can take as many um, petals you want i just took like this it looks quite pretty right now i'm going to tell you how to stick the uh, magnet so i'm just taking a piece of magnet See a magnet, and just I'm going applying a fabricol. You can use A plus or you can use fabric glue or anything. So uh, according to me, my suggestion is you have to fix the magnet before the clay gets dry. If not, it will not stick properly. You have to use any hard uh, substance like uh, uh, Fabi Bond or uh, uh, A six thousand E six thousand like that uh, for sticking. Okay. So, uh, if your clay is not dry, you can stick with this fabricol itself, or you can use fabric glue. Okay, for sticking. See. So now I'm going to uh, 
give uh, another thing i am just going to keep a um, just a face uh, just inside the round i am just keeping the face so just i am just rolling a small balls and just see the size of the ball very small it is a mustard size ball okay and just i am keeping it at the like this for the eyes okay see now i am just taking a very bit little bit amount of a clay and just rolling it like this flattering it and just i am keeping it for the mouth the same without without these petals you can use a smiley you can make as many of smileys of uh, fridge magnets right so this is the idea i am just giving you see here it is that uh, i hope it is clear okay so uh, let it dry once it get dried we will start painting okay now i am going to tell you a uh, ice cream a uh, fridge magnet ice cream for that i am just taking a ball a, a quite big size ball and just rolling it one end as i told for petals i'm just rolling it one end so that you will have a cone shape just i am making the base the broader just making the base broader hum abhi ice cream banana ja rahe hain iske liye hum ek big size ball le rahe hain fir usko aise gumane se humko a cone shape mil jayega aap aise bhi kar sakte hain aur ऐसे आप रोल कर कर ऐसे होल करने से आपको कौन शेप आ जाएगा आप आप इसे भी कर सकते हैं ओके सो यू गेट लाइक दिस देन मे जस्ट मेक दिस एरिया फ्लैटर एंड देन टेक सम अमाउंट ऑफ क्ले एंड जस्ट रोल इट स्ट्रेटली यू कैन रोल इट स्ट्रेटली सी आई एम जस्ट रोलिंग इट स्ट्रेटली this you can take how much clay you want but make sure that the magnet become not becomes heavy okay now just you have to keep it and roll it like this i'm just okay If you twist, make a twist like this. It will be like a ice cream. Now I am just going to give the impression in the wafer area. This wafer area always in any ice cream will have some impression. For that, I am taking a small knife or you can take small scale, even any scale, or else even the molded cover. You can make this uh, impression with the cover. Just give a check like this. I will show you near the camera. See here, and just. like this okay i hope it is clear see ya okay so at the back you have to paste the magnet you have to uh, stick the magnet here like this is that clear okay now i am going to tell you the other thing i am just going to make a lollipop okay kids like lollipop so basically i am um, i'm ta i'm taking classes for both teachers and students so basically when you take uh, classes for the students you, they love chocolates they love candies and uh, somewhat uh, uh, flavory items right so when you teach such items with clay they will enjoy doing they will uh, enjoy doing this okay you can encourage your kids even to do this these are very simple craft mainly done for uh, ch uh, children so i just take the a strip of clay i just rolled it like this and just making it a coil just rolling it like this and just rolling it like this you can make as much big as you can this is a candy lollipop candy Okay, now I kept left side. Now I take a small piece of uh, this and roll it in a broader way and just sticking it at the back. See, lollipop is ready. Hope you all like this. 
Now you can stick the magnet at the back. You can fix the magnet at the back. Okay. Here. You can stick the magnet. Then once it gets dry, you can start painting. Okay. Now I am going to tell you a beautiful little girl. A beautiful little girl. Okay. For that, I just take a quite big amount of clay. Okay. I am taking a quite big amount of clay and just making it as a cone. See, I just make the cone. This is my body part. I take some more amount of clay. This clay you can take it the size of the lemon. You can take the size of the lemon. Okay, and just I'm just keeping it like this. Okay. Now I'm just rolling the head part. And just rolling the head part and keep it on the top. Okay. Now I just take a little amount of clay, two little amount of clay for the hair. I'm just rolling it like this and just pressing it, pressing it to make it flatter. Okay. And just keeping it like this on the head. And I am giving the hair impression with the molded cover. I hope you all like this. Now I am just going to do a hand. For doing hand I am just taking like this. Just like this. And then. From the back, it should come front. You can keep it like this or you can keep it uh, any direction you want. You can uh, keep it in any direction you want. You can just keep it and uh, like you can say Namaste or something else. Okay. Now I am going to explain again in Hindi. For doll, you can take a big size alarm, uh, आपको एक बिग साइज बॉल लेना है लेमन का साइज लेना है फिर उसको ऐसे घुमाकर एक कोन बनाना है ऐसे कोन बनाकर ऐसे रखना है फिर एक छोटा साइज का बॉल लेकर उसके ऊपर रखना है उसके ऊपर रखना है फिर दो छोटा साइज बॉल लेकर उसे घुमाकर या यहाँ हार बाल रखना है फिर उसके बाद दो हाथ रखना है दो हाथ ऐसे ऐसे हाथ ओके नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू द अदर फ्रिज मैग्नेस एलिफेंट ओके द शेप ऑफ द एलिफेंट फेस एलिफेंट फेस ओके so in fridge magnets uh, in uh, basically in fridge we used to have a pen for noting the um, uh, for taking notes of the materials list or uh, any kitchen items we have a pen and paper with that so for holding the pen uh, if it is uh, in a fridge magnet when it is holding the pen it will be very useful item for you okay now i'm going to teach you that how to make that so for that i'm just taking a big size ball and just I am trapping it one side trapping it one end okay as I told you before you have to trap it one end so one end is trap, uh, lean and the one end is broad so you have to just spread out the head part this is the head part and you have to spread the head part okay now you take two balls and again you have to trap at it one side and just press it. That is the petal shape. You get a petal shape. Okay. Just press it. You get a petal shape. And just fix it at the back like this. 
okay see the ears are ready and this is the trump and eyes nose you can draw it with your uh, paint you can draw when it is painting once it get dry you can draw it now i'm just holding the trunk and just bringing it upward so that here i can hold the uh, pencil just like this i can hold the pen or pencil or whatever you like once it get dry it will just stand as stone so you, it, it, this will be helpful for holding the pencil this is a amazing uh, item very useful for all housewives see here like if you make like this here you will hold the pencil or pen or whatever you want okay and here you can draw the eyes etc so i hope these items are very useful for you now i'm going to teach you a cupcake okay so for cupcake i just took like this a ball and just making the cup that is like this the cupcakes are usually broader at the top and lean at the top bottom okay i have made the cup here i am giving the impression like this see here okay now i am taking the clay and rolling it this clay must be little bit lengthier so that if you take two clay and mix it and if you do that is also will be good i'll show you so i take two clay and just rolling it basically these uh, will not have definite shape um, that is the structure right so you can do whatever you want now i'm just rolling it like this see this type cupcakes magnets at the back cupcake okay now i just roll a ball and keep it at the top the cherries etc okay hope you all love this and uh, you can make all sort of many sort of uh, shapes etc uh, this is the just a beginning this is just a starting item and i have lot of um, uh, advanced model in this later i will teach you in my further sections so please follow me in my face, uh, facebook group uh, my page is unique institute of fashion designing and i'll send you the link and the other thing is i am taking workshop free workshops for every week every week i conduct one free workshop and many paid workshop too where you can learn professional all types of um, uh, clay works and paintings and many handmade items uh, so now i am going to teach you how to paint the um, our product now i am going to teach you how to paint the product okay so first i am going to take the um, flat which i which we done first okay so this is almost dry but it takes time it's take uh, nearly 20 or 30 minutes to for drying so i have done already previously i have done this so i am going to teach you how to paint in that i request everyone to just uh, uh, paint after the clay gets dried it will not good before if you paint before it, the paint gets dried okay so now i am using fabric paint and using fabric fabricral fabric color which is very good for your um, clay works when you are using in molded so i am using the fabricral colors okay there are lots of colors available so i am using that okay so i take so i take this and just giving it to the center part first 
I take a pink color. If the coloring is option, it depends upon you. You can use whatever color you want. So always I um, thing is when you are giving direct color, you give two coats. Okay. Otherwise, when you uh, when you are uh, finding your uh, uh, paint is very little bit uh, or uh, yeah, it is not sufficient, you can give a base white color and then you can start coloring with other color. Once it, the white color gets dry, you can start coloring. So, पहले हम एक color दे दे रहे हैं. आपको color नहीं तो ज़्यादा नहीं है तो आप पहले white color देकर फिर उसके बाद आप जो भी color चाहिए आप दे सकते हैं. मैं अभी पिंक दे दे चुकी हूँ, फिर मैं अभी रेड कलर लेकर वो पेटल्स को दे रही हूँ, मैं अभी रेड कलर पेटल्स को दे रही हूँ। पहले आप ऊपर वाला को फिनिश करने के बाद आप नीचे भी पेंट करना चाहिए ओ पीछे सो यू कैन पेंट वंस द क्ले फ्रंट पार्ट इज ड्राई यू कैन पेंट द बैक पार्ट आल्सो बैक साइड आल्सो So I have given two coatings that will be good for your product. Okay. So now I am going to uh, give other color. So before that I would like to teach you donut which is very, um, very wanted. Many of my students would like to do donut. So I thought I, I forgot before. So now I am going to teach you how to make donut. For making donut, I am uh, taking a ball, okay, that is the size depends upon you, I just take a ball, okay, and just I am flattering it, I am just flattering it, you can keep it on the table like this, okay, you can keep it on the table like this and just flatter it, okay, you can flatter it, then you can take any cap or any bottle or something and just make a hole at the center. You can make the hole at the center. See? Like this. And our donut is ready. So, see I have a crack here. Can you see this? I have a crack here. To, pour, uh, to avoid this, you can just take the talcum powder and just you can give massage over the crack so that it gets vanished. So, yeah. Now, you can see that 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 you can see मर्ज हो जाएगा वो क्रैक ही नहीं होगा सो यू हैव टू डू दिस प्रॉपर्ली बट द शेप मस्ट नॉट चेंज ओके द शेप मस्ट नॉट चेंज सी द क्रैक हैज गॉन ओके सो नाउ यू कैन फिक्स द मैग्नेट एट द बैक यू कैन फिक्स द मैग्नेट एट द बैक नेक्स्ट यू कैन just paint you can just start painting so i am going to tell you how to paint this for that i just take my brown color acrylic brown and then white color acrylic white you have to mix a little amount of white uh, you have to take some white color and mix little amount of brown to it okay i am just taking white I just took white and just adding little amount of brown to it. A very little amount of brown. Just a... See? 
a very little amount of and just mixing it you will get the color of the bun that is a sandal color a beautiful color it will be very beautiful the very natural too okay then you can give it to once the clay gets dried my my clay is almost dried which i have done earlier okay that clay is almost dried so i'm just start painting it see the color just very beautiful color this is actually um the color of uh, a bun okay so once the front part is over you can start coloring the back part okay so you have to color all the area okay so now i'm going to show the how to color let it dry i will finish the other and i will come it back So now I am just taking the brown color, for the ice cream I just take brown color, okay. And just do this okay let it dry once it get dry you can um, start coloring the other part okay this coloring it should be uh, done in um, in leaving time that is you have to color one part you have to wait till it die then you have to give the other uh, color it will not get merged that is the color both the color will not get mixed so that is the reason so previously I have taken the doll, done the doll and I have colored the uh, body part. Now I am going to show uh, how to do the other colors. Okay. So for that you can take any fish tan color which is available. If you don't have fish tan color, in the, previously I told you the white plus brown. You can mix both the color properly. You can mix the color So now I am just mix the both the color. This will give also the skin color. Okay. So now I am just painting the face of the doll. Just I am painting the face of the doll with the color. Hmm. I just mix the white and a pinch of brown. Just a small pinch of brown. This you can give two coats because uh, only then it will be nice. You can give two coats. When you are coloring friends part, you are also you have to color the back side also because when you look see here already I have shown this. Okay, for showing this one day I have not painted back. It, it will not look good. Okay, when you color it both the side only then it will be nice. So I am just coloring the whole part. Okay. Just I am giving color like this. Okay. Now. As I said previously. Once the color get dried. Only you have to uh, apply the other color. I am just going to paint the part which we have done before. So, 
just a minute. I am taking a brown color, direct brown, and just I am applying it over the donut. Just I'll show you. See, See this is the donut. Okay, I am just applying. This color, it depends upon you. You can use whatever color you have that is you want. So these are the So once it gets dried over the topping areas we can do more uh, items see Okay now I'm just going to give black color for the eyes that uh, flower we made right for that see here it's almost done so I'm just going to give the color for the eyes and just taking black color and just applying it on the eyes So when you teach children, they will love and they will enjoy doing this. Is that good? Hope you all love this. Similarly, you have to paint the back part also. Once the front part gets right, you have to uh, turn it and you have to back, uh, paint the back part also. Only then it will be nice. Okay, now I am going to, yes, black, when I am using the black brush, so I am just going to paint the hair part for the doll. Okay, I will just make, bring it near the camera. I am just painting the hair part for the doll. So the paint will dry in 5 minutes. So you can start painting uh, quickly. Now I am just going to give the eyes black. And for lips, I am just going to give a red or pink. See here. Okay, now I am going to just give a recoating for the doll. Always you have to paint two times, uh, that is uh, when you don't use white color as a base. So I am just going to give a touch up for the doll. Okay, I am just giving a touch up like this. See here. Isn't it pretty? Okay. Now uh, the ice cream too. I am just going giving a red color for the ice cream. And just, uh, my donut is not yet dried, so I will just show you the other thing. See here, 
upon the donut which I have painted, I have just used liners. You can use any liners or you can use any fine brush to just give the toppings. Okay, here the topping is done. So you can do that also. So I hope you all love the section. I do love teaching you. So try this. This is very amazing art with clay. This is the easiest part. This is the basic item. So try this at home and then give your feedbacks. I just want uh, your feedbacks. And uh, in next further classes, I am going to teach you something um, professional or uh, something advanced model. So uh, do follow me in my Facebook uh, page, Unique Institute of Fashion Designing. And my name is Karthi Shwari. You can follow my Facebook ID too. Uh, so be in touch with me and um, we will do more further classes. You will, I will sure you will learn a lot and you can make this as a profession. This is an amazing professional uh, area where you can make each and every item as your professional. This can be done for your written gifts. You can uh, take orders and do it for written gifts and you can gift your friends and uh, uh, anyone and um, this uh, can be used for uh, not only this out of uh, we are making we are going to make many large number of projects where you can learn and you can make your own business. So I want each and everyone to get uh, involved in it and you can do it and you can start your own business. Uh, so that will help you for your future and um, all the best for you all. Thank you. Thank you one and all.